Hello there! This is Emily Sugars, and you're watching Emily Sugars. I just really wanted to say that. I'm definitely a fan of the new YouTube name opposed to the old one, because Molly Monkey 90210 is strange. So I've been in like a super duper mood lately. It could or could not be because of yesterday. Now yesterday, I went to the Appleton Mall. Hold up, Sonny. It's not because I saw you. <laughs> no. Yeah, about that, it's really gross, and you should probably just shave it off because you've lost any cuteness you had left to you. Out the door, flying away, it's gone. But anyways, so after I went to the Appleton Mall, I was coming back, coming back home, and we decided, me and Melissa, that we would stop in Oshkosh for some ice cream at Culver's. So, we're in the drive-thru at Culver's, ordering ice cream, Melissa wants some cheese curds, and she's like, oh, ask for some ketchup, but I forgot to because he had us pull ahead to get cheese, to get the cheese curds later because they weren't ready yet. So then he comes, this really cute guy comes walking out and gives us the cheese curds, and oh my gosh, he's so adorable, and you can tell he's not a douchebag because... He was like, oh, were you guys the ones that paid with the gift card? Because I didn't know who did it, who like swiped it, and I was like, and he was just trying to come up with this explanation as to why he didn't remember that we paid with a gift card, and it was just cute, and you're just like, that is not a douchebag, that's a real guy in there. Of course, my douchebag meter has been wrong before. So then, we pulled ahead, and then Melissa was like, oh, we forgot ketchup. I was like, okay, well, I'll just go through the drive through again and just get some ketchup quick. And so we went through the drive through and right when we come up to the speaker box thing, they must have a camera, because he started laughing. <laughs> He's like, oh, they're back in the minivan, of course. And I'm like, oh, can we just have some ketchup? And he's like, sure, pull ahead. And he's just laughing. And um, we come up to the window, and he gives us the ketchup, and he's like, oh, do you have enough ketchup? Do you need any more? And I was like, no, we probably shouldn't be coming through this drive through again. He's like, oh. I don't care if you come through, you can go through again. So of course, we pulled through the drive-thru again. And we went up to the speaker box, and I was like, can we have some ranch? And he was like, sure, pull ahead. So we pulled ahead, and he gave us the ranch. And Melissa is like, hey, can we have your number? He's like, wrote it on the ranch. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so cute got this ranch right here. Um, I brought it to school to show people as proof that I got a guy's number. And I put it in my backpack because I'm dumb. And my books broke it. And now it's, I had ranch all over my backpack. Not to mention, now the number is not on this anymore. You can barely see some blue around the edges. We don't even know if we got his number right because it was smudged when he gave it to us, which could or could not have been on purpose. So me and Melissa might have to go through that drive through again. Or just go to Culver's and track him down because <laughs> he was really cute. So that's the end of my story because I really wanted to tell that story because it's like the, pretty much the greatest story I've ever been allowed to tell. I have some other pretty great stories, but for the sake of embarrassing someone who might be watching this, I'm not going to tell those stories. Dang you, Emily! Dang you! Excuse me? Hmm, I would look terrible with facial hair, wouldn't I?